Hi, my name is Sarah Salama. I'm from the Midwestern University Chicago College of Pharmacy. Hi, I just picked up my prescription. Hi, my name is Sarah. I'm the pharmacist here. Um, yes, it looks like I do have a prescription ready for pickup. What's your first and last name? Uh, Elias Thompson, T-H-O-M-S-O-N. Perfect. And are you still on Canadian way? Uh, yes. Okay. And are you picking up this prescription for yourself? Myself, yes. Wonderful. Okay, so the purpose of our session today is to just review some of the important points about this new medication for you. I can help answer any questions that you have. Um, and really my goal is for you to feel confident using this medication on your own after this. Do you have a couple minutes to talk together? Sure. Okay, wonderful. Um, are you taking any over-the-counter or herbal medications at this time? No. Okay. Are you taking any um, other uh, creams or ointments? No. Okay. Do you have any medication allergies? I do not. Wonderful. And um, how comfortable would you say you are completing medical forms on your own? Pretty capable. Okay, great. And have you gotten a chance to get the COVID-19 vaccine yet? I have not. Okay. Well, if that's something that you're interested in, I would recommend just getting in touch with the county representatives. Um, they'll be the fastest people to get you in touch with a vaccine. Okay? Sure. Wonderful. And um, in terms of this new medication, what did the doctor tell you the medication was going to be used for? Um, so the, the past couple of months have been you know, kind of rough, um, some more rough than others. I feel like I'm more on the rough end of things. Um, um, I, I lost my job and um, also my um, um, I also um, lost like my best friend. Uh, she overdosed and you know she didn't make it. Um, so after speaking with uh, Dr. Andrews, uh, we kind of thought that <clears throat> that uh, the medication probably be you know like my best route for things um, because the last thing that I want is to do or go down a road that you know I don't. I, I don't want to go down, so I feel like this medication is probably yeah, it's it's my best option at this point. So for sure, yeah, I'm so sorry to hear about the loss of your friend. Um, really, I am. If there's anything that I can do to help, um, kind of in this transition as we get you started on this new medication, um, or even beyond that, please feel free to reach out. You know, I'd be more than happy to help you in whatever capacity I can. Okay, again, I'm very sorry about your friend. Um, however, with this medication, just like the doctor mentioned, um, it will kind of help with um any depression, any like sad moods, any anxiety that you may have too. Um, so this really is a great step for you kind of moving forward to take care of yourself. And I think that's amazing. Um, so with this medication, the doctor wrote for a medication by the name of uh, Venlafaxine. And this is a 75 milligram extended release capsule. Now I do have it here with me. So I just wanted to show you it really quickly, just so that you're familiar with what it may look like. Um, and the doctor wants you to take one capsule by mouth daily um, for about 30 days. And what did the doctor tell you to expect with this medication? Um, what to expect, uh, just that, just to help overcome my depression and um, to come back in a month or so to revisit. Absolutely, yeah. So this medication will kind of be used just for that. Um, in terms of side effects with this medication, um, it can cause some weight loss, some shakiness, um, or a little bit of sweating. So th those are some, some things that you wanna watch out for on the day-to-day. Um, if you experience any side effects um, that are a little bit more drastic, like shortness of breath or chest pain, those are some things that you would want to let the doctor know about more immediately, okay? okay. Um, this medication can be taken with food at the same time every day. Um, you'll also want to make sure avoid, um, that you avoid driving or using alcohol until you know how this drug works in your body. Um, people have kind of different reactions, so it'll be important to watch out for those two things. Um, it's also important to note not to stop this medication on your own, um, kind of keep taking it as you're instructed. And lastly, there are some, um, you know, increased suicidal thoughts with this medication. Um, so it's important to have a support system around you. Maybe let your family know that you're taking it so that they can help you through this. And I'm a resource for you as well myself. Sure. Um, if you miss a dose of the medication, take it as soon as you remember. Um, and there is one refill on this medication. So when you're done with this one, you can come back in for another. And finally, go ahead and store it at room temperature. Now, I know we covered a lot of information. So can you just highlight some of the big points? Um, take it once daily. Um, store, like what you just said, store in a dry place um, once a day. Don't double dose. Uh, take with food is important. 
and mm -hmm. um, don't drive and or use with alcohol. Perfect. So I'll go ahead and follow up with you next week over the phone. Um, but if you have any questions in the meantime, feel free to give me a call back. Okay.